of over $10,000 in prizes. Is this one of them? Or is it this one? Or is this one? We'll find out in a moment in this game of hide and seek as these nine celebrities. Comedy star Nipsey Russell. Movie star Shelley Winters. The one and only Pearl Bailey. Humorist Orson Bean. Comedian Jan Murray. Emmy winner Vicki Lawrence. Co-star Rhoda Ann Mira. The Price is Right's Bob Barker. In good times, Jimmy Walker. All join us in playing Right the Bunny. Once again, to break the bank, where our nine celebrities will try to help two contestants make three in a row and thereby break the bank, hopefully winning $10,000 or more in prizes. Speaking of the two contestants who will be on all show, who are they, Ernie? She's a university student majoring in child psychology. Meet Kay Moss. And an insurance company manager whose hobbies are surfing and skiing, meet Dwayne King. Dwayne, welcome to Break the Bank. I wish you both good luck and hope you do break the bank. Kay, you are studying child psychology. Are you a married lady? Yes, I am. And you have children of your own? Yes. No, I don't. Oh, you don't. children I have. And then you'll be able to use the study. Yes. Very good. Okay, Dwayne King, where do you do your surfing and skiing? I do a lot of surfing in Malibu and I go skiing all over the United States. Are you a married man too? No, I'm not. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> Look at that. How the audience likes this fellow. Let me explain to both of you how the game works, and to our audience at home as well. Our celebrities are seated around a great big board, covered up by numbers now. When they're uncovered, you will see three $100 boxes, all touching on one side. Three $300 boxes, touching on one side, but in a little different pattern. Three $500 boxes, touching on one side, but again in a different pattern. There are five money bags they may touch, or they may not touch. There are five blank spaces. Get a blank space, you lose your turn. And there's a wild card which can be used to make three of anything and can be found anywhere. Get three of the money boxes and you win the game and the amounts that are there. Get three of these money bags and you break the bank, which is worth over $10,000. Whoever wins the most games during this next half hour will be eligible to play the bonus game. Backstage, we tossed a coin, and Kay Moss, you won the toss. Moss won the toss. <laughs> and pick two celebrities by selecting a number. Okay, number seven. Number seven for Pearl Bailey and Orson Bean. Number oh. seven is worth $100. <laughs> hey, here's your question. Now, you're going to hear one correct answer and one from one celebrity and a false answer from the other. Pick oh. the correct answer and you capture the box. Pearl? Okay. Yeah? You're between 35 and 50. Who is? Hi. <laughs> You're still talking to me. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking oh, to you, but not necessarily about you. Otherwise, I would have said between 20 and 25. Yeah, oh, well, of course. Yeah. <laughs> In this question, the person is between 35 and 50 uh -huh. and have had children. Yeah. What are the odds that their next offspring will be twins? Now, if you were talking about me, <coughs> there'd be some heavy odds. Heavy. Oh, maybe, uh, uh, I would say, <laughs> me, 35 and 50. Mm. Between. Oh, between, I see. <laughs> well, I would say maybe one in, uh, not 100,000, one in 50,000. One in 50,000. Orson Bean, how do you feel about that? Oh, uh, this is the sort of thing I happen to know, Jack. I am a walking compendium of useless information. <laughs> <laughs> Assuming that between the ages of... 35 and 50, you want to have a baby at all and can find someone to cooperate in the venture with you. You're, it's a family hour. Oh, all right. Your odds are between 1 and 50, not Which is the correct time. answer for the $100 box? Uh, 1 in 50,000. Excuse me? The 1 in 50,000? No, it's 1 in 50. Orson was right. You lose the $100 box and it goes over to your opponent, Dwayne yeah. King. And a mustache will be on that box to show he won it. When a pair of lips are on it, it means a lady has won the box. Your pick, Dwayne. I'll pick number eight. Number eight for Jan Murray and Orson Bean. Number eight is worth three hundred dollars. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Jan, listen carefully. You have just committed herbicide. What exactly did you kill? I committed herbicide. Yes. What I kill? Right. My uncle Herbie. <laughs> or as Nipsey. <laughs> Nipsey Russell.
impossible for the answer. I shot an arrow in the air. It fell to earth, I knew not where. But when I saw Uncle Herbie sing and dance, I know I got him in his pants. <laughs> Kill. Oh, I'd like to do another few minutes because I'm not on evenings anymore. I, uh, no, I would say I would, if when I when I committed Uncle Herb no a herbicide, I killed an insect. An insect or some bean. Now you did not kill an insect. You went out in the garden and you did a very an equally cruel thing. Oh, you shot a little good. flit on a poor oh, little plant, oh, maybe oh, a weed. Mr. Confetti. Herbis vulgaris is the proper name. <laughs> the three hundred dollars. Which is it? I'd say it's a plant. It's a plant. That's right. I need to collect the three hundred dollars. Okay, I have a hundred, three hundred. We'll find out who breaks the bank of anybody who wins the game after this. It'll be your turn to play again in just a moment, Dwayne, but may I remind both of you that if either of you are lucky enough to break the bank, you'll win a whole bunch of prizes, including a Citizens Band radio, a dining room set, a recliner, a pool table, a stereo, a movie camera, luggage which you can use on your trip to Rome, and this beautiful car. It's the new Opel Isuzu, a two-door coupe with four-speed transmission offers a combination of performance with economy. The new Opel Isuzu by Buick. And to keep your car shining, Lean Dance Car Wax lasts longer than any leading car wax. Water beating bruise and DuPont guarantees it. Okay. Wayne, Wayne King, you're still the king, so keep on playing. I'll pick number two. Number two, you know they touch on one side, you're hoping for another one under all the box. It's for Pearl Bailey and... <laughs> I'm sorry, you pick up a turn, came on. Okay. Number nine. Number nine for Ann Mira and for Orson Bean. And the number nine is worth... <laughs> it was your turn. Back to you, Dwayne. Oh. I will pick number one. Number one for Nipsey Russell and Shelley Winters. Number one is a money bag. <laughs> now, you can keep that, but you lose your turn, and you get two more. You break the bank worth over $10,000, or you can turn it back and keep on playing and try to remember where it is. Which do you want to do? I'll turn it back. All right, remember where it is. It could come handy later. Where do you want to go now? Number 12, please. Number 12 for Pearl Bailey and Vicki Lawrence. Number 12 is another money bag. Ah, you have a decision. You want to turn it back, or do you want to keep it? Turn it over. I'll turn it back. Turn it back. Remember where it is. You may want to use it later on. Where do you go now? I'll go to number three. Number three for Jan Murray and Shelley Winters. Number three is worth three hundred dollars. Oh, ah. If you pick the right answer, all right, Jan. The question: What does the A in Henry A. Kissinger stand for? Marcus Tung. <laughs> Atlantic Treaty? No. Oh. Uh, Arthur, of course, everyone knows Arthur, that. Arthur, okay. Yes. Shelley Winters. Uh, Henry A. Kissinger. What's the A for? <laughs> Can't be Adolf. <laughs> Alfred! Alfred. All right, for the three dollar box, which is it? I'd say Arthur. No, it's Alfred. That Shelley Winters is right. And your opponent captures the three dollar box, and her lips, lips go on that. Keep That's on playing k -Mos. Okay, number 13. Number 13 for Jan Murray and Vicki Lawrence. Number 13 is a play. <laughs> Your turn, Dwayne. Okay, I'll go with number four. Number four for Ann Mira and Shelley Winters. Number four is worth $300. Okay. And here's the question. And what kind of meat goes into true Irish stew? Uh, before I answer, I want to say that this Irish stew was put into this beautiful African dress by Pearl Bailey. She gave me it. Isn't it beautiful? It is lovely. Yeah. From Liberia. I just want to you can't say you like something. Pearl just gives it to you. May I say? Irish stew. What? This, this New York Jew was put into this jacket by Mipsy Russell. Mipsy Russell. <laughs> now, what kind, of, what kind of meat, Anne, goes into true Irish stew? Oh, lamb. You say lamb. What do you say, Shelley Winters? Oh, boy. Family hour. No, no. Mutton. Which is it, lamb or mutton? I'd say mutton. You say right, and you capture a three hundred dollar box. Yeah, sure. A 
pick number one now. Number one for Nipsey Russell and Shelly Winters. Number one is, as we know, a money bag. That's one of them. You want to keep it this time? <laughs> no, I think I'll turn it back. Oh, you're going to turn it back. Yeah. You were there before. Yeah, you right. forgot. You right? I told you to remember. Where do you want to go now? Where do you want to go? I'll go to number 14. Number 14 for Ann Mira and Vicki Lawrence. Number 14 is a $500 box. Okay, Ann. Here's the question. And according to People Magazine, what is reportedly Sophia Loren's biggest worry? Biggest what? Biggest. Nipsey. <laughs> biggest worry. What's Sophia Loren's biggest worry? I think Nipsey's right. Curvature of the spine. <laughs> No, uh, I think it's her career. Her career. What do you say, Vicki Lawrence? Uh, no, I'm not. It's too obvious. Well, uh, I'll, uh, maybe she lives in Italy. Crime, maybe crime. All right. Which do you think it is? I'd say crime. Crime in Italy is right. Absolutely. You are a five and a half box. been entertaining our audience here during the commercials, but it's your turn to play, Dwayne King. I'll pick number 10. I beg your pardon? I'll pick number 10. Number 10 for Jimmy Walker and Orson Bean. Number 10 is a money bag. <laughs> now what are you going to do? You've seen where three of them are. Right. What do you want to do? Turn it back. I'll have to have a decision, Dwayne. I'll take the money bag. You'll take the money bag this time. Yeah. And you have one of them. Two more, and you know where they are. If you can get them in time, we'll win you $10,000. K Moss, your turn. Okay, I'll take number one. Number one. She's going for it, too. Remember, that's a money bag. May we see number one, please? That's it. You want to keep that money bag? I do. She's going to keep it to tie things up. So you have one and he has one, but you have to lose your turn. Okay, Dwayne King. I'll take number 12. Number 12. He's trying to remember if that's where the other money bag was. Let's take a look at number 12. Yes. You want to keep it this time? You want to keep it. You have two. One more, you break the bank worth $10,000. Where do you want to go, K Moss? Uh, number five. Number five for Jimmy Walker and Shelly Winters. What is number five of blank? Oh, here's a golden opportunity. Where do you go, Dwayne? Number 18. If number 18 is a third money bag, he breaks the bank and wins over $10,000. May we see box eight? Yeah! other lovely gifts. It's a CB radio from Radio Shack, a complete citizen's band radio system featuring their famous realistic single sideband AM two-way radios and archered antennas for your home and car. Plus a Broyhill dining room featuring embossed door panels, massive double crown china with cathedral-shaped doors highlight this elegant suite from Broyhill. Then enjoy Dentine. You'll taste the difference with Dentine. It has a snappy, tingly flavor all its own. Dentine makes your mouth taste clean, not sweet. Now relax on a new Lazy Boy wall recliner that can be placed one inch from the wall. You can recline to any position with the footrest up or down. It's Lazy Boy. Next, a full table and stereo. Selected from one of 4,800 Western Auto stores. Western Auto, the complete family store featuring items for home, auto, and leisure living. Then, from GAF, a 505 XL Super 8 sound movie camera. Five times power zoom men's automatic exposure. And a GAF. 3100 S Super 8 sound movie projector with sound recording features. The exciting sound motion picture system from GAF. Next, luggage by a spring from Lee's. The look of European continental fashion crafted by Lee's to be sturdy and durable the moment you pick it up. You're on the continent. And use this luggage in Rome, Italy. Exploring the Eternal City of an unforgettable shopping adventure on the Via Gaddafi. It's all from Creative World Travel, from Break the Bank, prizes worth over $10,000. There's a happy man. Really, that beautiful opal is blue, blue, and all those marvelous gifts, and a trip to Rome. Well, Dwayne, you are now eligible, of course, to play the bonus game as well. You could win another $5,000. You, uh, we're going to play another game, however. Kay, you went first in the first game, and even though he just broke the bank, which is marvelous for him, he will go first in the second game. So, Dwayne King, pick a box. I'll pick number 11. Number 11. Now, we don't have time to get any questions or answers, so we'll just alternate turns. Whoever gets three of a kind wins. But we see box number 11, please. Okay, you have a 
lucky bag. Three more of those, two more of those, and you break the bank a second time. Okay, K Moss, your 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 pick. Okay, number seven. Number seven. May we see what's behind number seven? It is another money bag. You each have one. Two more for either of you would do the trick. All right, Dwayne King. I'll pick number twelve. Number twelve. Let's see what's behind number twelve. It's a blank. <laughs> Hey, Moss. Uh, number three. Number three, going up to the top. Let's see what she finds behind box number three. It's a money bag. You have two money bags. One more and you would break the bank. Okay, Dwayne. I'll pick number 13. Number 13. He's looking for another money bag or anything else. May we see box number 13. It's a wild card. That's as good as a money bag because you can use that for anything, anywhere. Both players have two money bags. If either one gets another, they break the bank. K. Moss. Okay, number nine. If number nine is a third money bag, you break the bank worth over $10,000. May we see box number nine. Nope, it's $500. And that's yours. Not too bad. If you get two more of those, you'd win the game. Duane. I'll pick number 17. If number 17 is the third money bag, he would break the bank for over $10,000. May we see number 17. It's a $300 box. You, in effect, now have two money bags and two $300 boxes. Three of these, anything, would win the game. Your pick, Kay. Okay, number 14. Still looking for a third money bag. Is this the third money bag for 10 No, Ooh, you've got tough luck. Make a pick, Dwayne. I'll pick number 15. Looking for either a $300 box or a money bag. Is it? Let's see. What number was that? 15. That's a, you got a $500 box. You have two $500 boxes, two $300 boxes, two money bags. Your turn came off. Okay, number 10. She's still looking for the third money bag. Is this the third money bag? May we see it? It's a $500 box. You've got two five. You all have two of everything. Your turn, Dwayne. I'll pick number 19. A 300 or a 500 or a money bag would win. Let's see, number 19. You win the game with $900. This wide-angle Toshiba TV has 185 square inches of the black stripe picture tube for more brightness, higher contrast. Features the Econowatt switch to save energy. Slimline styling from Toshiba. There you have it. Very well played, Dwayne. This is all kind of bad news to you, kid. You are right there fighting all the time, but we have a lovely group of consolation prizes for you. Let's all say goodbye nicely to Kay Moss, the lovely lady. And we'll be back to play the bonus game for $5,000 after this. Dwayne King, you're winning over $11,000 in cash and prizes, and you also got the right now to play our bonus game, which could bring you $5,000 more. Each of our celebrities has a card in front of them worth anywhere from $200 to $1,000. One celebrity has the word bust. You can keep on by intuition picking celebrities. As long as there's money there, you're okay. If the word bust comes up, you lose it all. We'll give you a chance to stop or go after each amount. What does your intuition tell you? Who's got the amounts for you? I'll take Vicky. Vicky Lawrence, what do you have for this young man? I haven't looked. All right. Oh, good stuff. Woo! That thousand dollars is yours if you quit now. If the word bust comes up, you lose it. If you get the two thousand dollars, we'll give you all the way up to five thousand dollars. Go, Bob. Bob Barker. Bob? Sorry, I've dozed off. You mean you've called on me? Yes. It's been such an exciting show for me so far. I have. $800. $800. That made it more exciting, Bob. Well, thank you. You now have $1,800. If you can get to $2,000 without getting the word bust, and that could be on the next one, either way, you would lose everything if the word bust comes up. If you get to $2,000, we'll give you two and a half times that or five grand. Do you want to stop now or try to go for the $2,000? Okay, he's going. Who do you pick? This will be it. I'll go with Ann. Ann Mira. What do you have for him? No bust. <laughs> no, 800. Oh, oh, oh. There you have it. Here's a fellow who is winning now in cash and prizes. $16,400. Where are you going to spend the money on the trip? 
I'm uh, probably on the trip, I think. Yeah. You, you did say earlier you were single. Yeah. You have a, a steady girlfriend or anything like that? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. You think she'll like it that you're blessed? She'll love it. I bet she will. <laughs> well, we want to wish you much happiness, success on your trip to the Rome and with the car that you've won, the Opal Azuzu. And I know that you want to join me in saying thanks to the uh, time. Thank all of you. Some of them didn't get a chance to say too much, but you're uh, they're all here. We say goodbye to Nipsey Russell with gratitude. Thank she you, really? Nipsey. Who had the go? bus? Did you have the bus, Nipsey? Nah, look oh, Jan it. Murray had the ah. word bus. Goodbye to Nipsey Russell and to Shelley Winters. Shelley, delightful to have you here. Pearl Bailey. Delightful to have you. Ambassador to the United Nations Council. And Orson Bean, thank you, Orson. Jan Murray, who had the bus. And Vicky Lawrence, the player, have you here. And Nura, and the two silent fellows on this show for some reason, Bob Walker from the Bright and Bright, and Jimmy Walker. We hope you like Break the Bank, and if you did, I hope you make it a point to be with us on this station next week at the same time. Until then, Jack Barry saying, be with us when we break the bank. bite-sized tabby. The meat neat in the small can. Tabby cat food looks, serves, smells neat. Beef, liver, chicken, and other meaty varieties. And from Peter Paul, York peppermint patties. A cool combination of dark chocolate and mint. Bite into a York peppermint patty and get the sensation. And Lipton makes a better burger, makes better meatloaf. Meatballs, chili, lasagna, tacos, makes a better burger, makes ground beef tastier. All new freezer crowd is unflinching. Don't worry, paramedics are standing by. Unwavering. Definitely. I think it should have been me. He better have said me. And swears to tell the truth. Oh, I hate to answer this question. The whole truth. Better have said his wife or else he's sleeping on the couch tonight. And nothing but the truth. Guys, I hope you brought something to read because the ride home could get real quiet. All new threes a crowd. Find out who knows you best. Weeknights at 9.30 Eastern, 6.30 Pacific, only on Game Show Network. It's a Barry and Enright production. Columbia TriStar Television.